Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. In 1909, the Natchez Color Cemetery was purchased approximately 17 acres of land north of Natchez from Albert E. James for $500 and five promissory notes of $700. The transaction established the Color Cemetery, today known as the Walking Street Cemetery. The burial ground contains the graves of 24 veterans from for various wars. At least one has a purple heart, who has some have been born during slavery time, and three mass graves of those who perished in the Rhythm Nightclub fire. Over the years, there is also 31 individual graves for the Rhythm Nightclub victims. Several funeral home directors managed the private owned cemetery. Sadly, the cemetery was without regular maintenance and deteriorated badly. In 2005, Delma White organized the Worthy Women of Walking Street Cemetery Association to restore and maintain this historical African American burial ground. Today, the Worthy Women have removed trees and debris and cleared undergrowth as well as having petition the city office to install drainage and gravel lane. They are active involved in cataloging tombstone information and decorating the graves of veterans. We have also installed section markers and entrance signs, a mon monument to identify the burial site of the Rhythm Night Club victim. My name is Dwight DeSantis, a part of the Worthy Women Association for the Walking Street Cemetery, which I have been a part of since 2005. This has been my home area, and this is the Natchez History, History Minutes for 2016.